As we get into the development, there is the Four Seasons sign out front. We're looking at a Zen garden with a water fountain. We get back into the back area with plenty of seating around where the uh, in-ground pool is. It's heated and the hot tub. There's a barbecue area. There's the clubhouse. Here is the entrance. It's double doors. The outside is open for your mail and deliveries. The inside is locked. It requires a fob to open. There's the vestibule where the elevators are. We get down to the first door on the left in the hallway, number 453. In the unit, you see 42 inch cabinets in the kitchen, upgraded appliances, a black granite countertop, and wooden floors in the kitchen and living room area. Five inch floors, they're beautiful. We get into the living room, there's the triple slider that's out to the balcony. You can see recessed lighting and ceiling fans. The first door to the right is the master bedroom. It has ample size for a king or queen size bed and furniture. It also has recessed lighting and fan. We're going to turn around now and we're going to look into the bathroom. We're going to go through the closet area and get into the master bath, which has a double sink and a glass door shower um, and some handicap accessible handles inside there. Um, we can back out of this and we're going to look into the master bedroom walk-in closet as we back out. You'll see on the right hand side the walk-in has ample storage space. Um, we can look across to, there's a double closet right across from that. We're going now straight across the living room into what is the second bedroom, which has its own bathroom on that side, the main bath. We see recessed lighting and upgraded in the unit. This is a tankless hot water heater that was just installed, part of the hot water and heating system. There's central air in the unit also. As we get down, we're gonna back out and look into the hall that goes down to the bathroom. The, the main bath. We just passed the laundry, which we'll show you in a minute, but this has a tower, uh, I'm sorry, a shower and tub unit in it. Uh, we'll back out of this and we're going to look into the closet where the laundry room is. There's a washer dryer that stays with the unit. And now we'll go out to the living room area, pan that again, seat to the kitchen. We're going to walk out of the door and go down to the hallway and show you the basement where the garage is uh, and the elevators down to it. Here we push ground, we go down to the ground floor. Here is the parking area. It's completely private. You get your own space, number 21. It has a storage closet. You can access it with a garage door opener. As we get into the vestibule, we're going to go back up into the elevator and we're going to go to the first floor where we are. Into the vestibule, we're going to see the double elevator area again and go outside. This is the front door of the unit, uh, of the building, and there's the unit right there.